Hello Utawala people wherever you are, hope you're having a good time. This is the second part and uh, in this uh, video I'll be taking you from Astral petrol station all the way through uh, Eastern Bypass Road uh, cutting across the Utawala area and taking you to Utawala shopping mall then from Utawala shopping mall we will drive down to Fahari Gardens Hotel, one of the best hotels uh, around Utawala. Yeah, so let's uh, kick off as you can see from the map demonstration. That is the route that we're going to follow. In between, I'll explain the different uh, places found along the way, the bus stops and the businesses uh, around. So yeah, join me in this journey. Karibu sana. So we're starting our journey. This is Astral Petrol Station, uh, which is the first entry point as you get into Utawala. We're now driving down towards Utawala. On your right side is a GSU training camp, on uh, which you're not allowed to film because it's a government uh, installation. We're now entering the Ola Petrol Station, which is the second petrol station as you enter Utawala. And you can see the old neighbors building which caught fire some time back when Naivas supermarket started in Utawala a few months after Naivas started, which has uh, since been renovated and Naivas resumed operations. So this was formerly uh, Libya, which is uh, uh, transformed into Ola. And there's some shops around uh, this area, uh, around Ola petrol station, including the Naivas supermarket and people stop here to do some shopping uh, while they proceed to their homes as, get, as they get into Utawala. So we are exiting the Ola petrol station uh, into the next uh, key area, which is the Shooters uh, Inn stage, uh, very famous. That is the first uh, of the bus stops as you approach uh, or, or you enter Utawala. After GSU, then uh, the next uh, famous uh, bus stop is the Shooters Inn. So this is a shopping area around uh, Shooters, which has many, many businesses. It has laundries, insurance companies, uh, shops. Sometimes you can buy uh, groceries along here. People do bring groceries. So this is the Shooter stage here. We are entering the Shooters stage. And this road, when you enter through this road, it goes all the way to Kayole. This road will take you all the way to Kayole. So that is the shooter's area. Uh, we are rejoining the main road towards uh, the main road now. This is uh, now uh, this is the shooter's area. Also, it has several businesses. That is the shooter's inn restaurant and the name shooters in uh, actually comes from the activities that go opposite this side which is a gsu training center and there's a shooting range so i believe that name came from uh, that shooting range which is a shooters in so we're driving down now towards utawala and our next uh, uh, in, uh, key point uh, or rather landmark that we're approaching is the ap training school which, is, which again is on your right side. Uh, that is the AP training school. Then we have a Kenya Commercial Bank. Kenya Commercial Bank started operations, I think, one or two years ago. And this is the area where they are found, including also Equity Afia Center. So we have an Equity Afia Center that is directly opposite the AP training uh, entrance. From there, we're now proceeding down to the next uh, key area, which is the Quick Mart supermarket. And this is where we find the Quachif stage. This is where we find the Quachif stage. Again, uh, very many businesses along the road. This is the place where you can buy meat. There are several butcheries here that sell meat at very affordable prices. So if you want quality meat, this area is where you will find the butcheries. So this is the Quick Mart uh, supermarket uh, alongside uh, and also you can see there is the Kingdom Bank, which has been taken by the Cooperative Bank. So this is the Kwachif uh, bus stop. This is the Kwachif bus stop. And you can see Matatus are stopping to drop passengers. 
after kwa chief we are now proceeding to we are entering now the amani area this is the amani area uh, we find a shell petrol station on your right this shell petrol station and then on your left we have a family bank we have family bank on your left again this is a center that has really grown very fast over the years uh, from uh, 2007 when people started settling in here on your opposite that's where gates was uh, on your on your on your right side and we are approaching the famous avery lounge hotel or dudes seasons 24 hotel which uh, recently came up i think last year and this is a very famous landmark now uh, so that is the avery lounge on your left as you can see there is the Avery Lounge. This is a money stage area. So this area is known as a money stage. There are two courts uh, known as a money court, a money court A and a money court B. Uh, we're leaving uh, Avery Lounge. This is where Bristol Hospital, you'll find Bristol Hospital here. And on the left, you can see the Maguna Supermarket. After Maguna Supermarket, we have the Tumaini Supermarket. So this area has got a lot of uh, service providers, a lot of companies, a lot of business, businesses going on. So that is a Tumaini area. And this is where you will find Cooperative Bank and Equity Bank. There is a market there. So now we are at the junction, the Benedictia Junction, and we are uh, entering to our right towards Gidongori. This is where we find Lexo Petrol Station. This is the Lexo Petrol Station. Uh, another petrol station. Uh, now we are exiting Lexo and into the road towards Utawala Shopping Mall. This we are now going towards Utawala Shopping Mall, and that is after taking your right diversion at the Benedicta stage. So this road will take us to Utawala Shopping Mall. And it also goes all the way to Gidongori. This is the area, this is the road that you can follow uh, to take you to Gidongori. Uh, so there are uh, businesses along the road, uh, many shops, uh, buildings, houses have also come up. Uh, we can see sometimes there is a problem of water, uh, those are some donkeys carrying water. Yeah, Utawala actually started growing up in the years of, from 2000s, that's when uh, people started uh, uh, building up in the area. And uh, between 2000 and, let's say, 5 to 2015, it mushroomed just like that. It just grew once. And it's been growing at that rate ever since it's a really really big town it's become a very big town a very big business hub as well so we are now approaching the turning towards Gedongori so if you drive to your left you'll be going to Gedongori and when you drive straight ahead you'll be going to Utawala shopping mall so today we're going to Utawala shopping mall so we drive straight ahead and this area, that's where you'll find the Real Hospital, which is just uh, a few meters from the Gitongori Junction. This is where you'll find a Real Hospital. And as we get near, as we get into, we are getting into the Utawala shopping area. This is the old Utawala main shopping area. This is where the main shopping was. Uh, after the road, the eastern bypass was constructed, then the Amani area took over as the center of Utawala. But this is uh, the old. So you can see the Utawala shopping mall, which was uh, a, a real big landmark. So when people came to Utawala, this is the first place they would land. The eastern bypass had not been constructed. After it was constructed, the roads uh, behind GSU and AP training school was closed and now the shopping center moved to Amani area. So that is the Utawala shopping mall. So we are driving uh, towards the end of the Utawala shopping mall and it, it borders the airport's land. This borders the airport's land. And that brings us to the halt of the drive uh, from Astral petrol station to Utawala shopping mall. Uh, thank you. Thank you for being 
uh, here. We can see some beautiful buds, folds. So someone has really kept nice buds here. Yeah. Mass roll petrol station all the way down to Benedicta area. Then from Benedicta area into Utawala shopping center which was the main shopping center when Utawala was uh, setting up. So I'm on a rough road currently and I'm hitting the tarmac road in a few. Uh, then we shall go to Fahari Hotel, one of the best hotels around Utawala. And then we'll end up, uh, we'll end this video there for today. Then the next time, we will do the Gizongori area and going onwards all the way to Roy. So this is the Kinka area. You can see Kinka and Kinka hardware. And that is the road towards Gizongori. That's the road towards Gizongori where that car is going. That, this is the road that goes back to Benedicta. We have Utawala. Estate Health Center. This is uh, the junction where we have oil marks, petrol station, and we see we have the capital shopping mall. Then we're heading down to Fahari Hotel. So we are approaching Fahari Hotel. They do not allow filming, but I'm not going inside. So I'll just slowly pass by the Fahari Hotel. Slowly pass by as I film it. There you can see the Fahari Hotel. And then I'll turn, I'll turn back. So that is the Fahari Hotel.